Hello current friends and future friends alike. Uh, check it out. I've got a new outfit today. I'm gonna put it on screen right there. Oh wait, nope. It's over there. <laughs> Good. And with a new outfit comes new abilities. I can do this now. Yeah, look at that. I can hold tea. <laughs> and this. <laughs> it took forever to do. All right. Enough messing around. Let's escape the void and go play some Celeste. Everyone, we are technically finishing the beginner lobby today. How exciting is that? Uh, I know I said that the last time I played, I was considering doing like a vanilla episode to kind of pace things apart. But since then, I may have accidentally spoiled something for myself. Nothing major. It's just I picked up the soundtrack for the beginner lobby which has been amazing. I love listening to it in the car and uh, I'm, I'm too excited to not play it. So we're starting with this one, which is has to be the core. Saken City. <laughs> That's right. By Believer 9 and Melario. Not only is it our last, I guess, official level in the logbook, but it's also a hard level. This should be fun. It already starts off great because we've got a car to bounce on. And of course the music. The music's good too. Now what do you suppose that block does? Because <laughs> I have no clue. It slowly does that. <laughs> oh, it's one of- it's an actual core block. Of course you can city, of course. <laughs> of course. Of course. <laughs> it's- it's too early in the morning for this. <laughs> All right, I got it. I got it this time. I figured it out. And that's what happens when you get rocketed into a block at high speeds. <laughs> you perish. These are good things to know. These are very good things to know. <laughs> okay, you gotta admit, that was pretty good. Stop it. Whatever I'm doing, stop it. Ah! I'm so close! Alright, time to find out what I'm actually supposed to do, I think. It's something like this. In a way, I was actually onto the right thing. I just uh, was trying something a little sillier than intended. But to be fair, I like my silliness. I like where, I'm, I like where my head was at. So am I racing this block? That's kind of cool. Or cold. Why do I actually- that's not where I want to go. Oh dear. Oh dear. Like I said, it's a little early in the morning. I'm working things out. I'll get there. I'll get there. <laughs> Shoot. Okay, hug the block. Jump down. Wait. Hug the block. Go. Go, go, go. Get the jump. Yes. Great. I actually really like the use of chaining those blocks together. That was really fun. Oh, and I'm gonna have to do this deathless too. I just remembered. All right, I better study up. I better pay attention. I better figure out what all of the stuff is doing and asking for of me. Where am I going? I feel like so much of that was out of my control. Still, this is kind of fun and fascinating. I like what I'm experiencing. Okay. You know, the block was outlined. It was it was totally telling me what was going to happen. I just didn't notice or pay attention whatsoever. Help. Be kind, I think. <laughs> okay. So I've got a couple ideas. I just don't know which is the right idea. I can do this. Now I have my dash back. This gets me over here. And I can still do this. Hang out here for a second. <laughs> I'm missing this one token. Don't do it. <laughs> don't block me. What have I done? <laughs> All right. That's going to be pretty much like the... <laughs> the core mechanic of this level, I think. There it is. <laughs> 
Nope. Ah, oh, too low. Oh man, if I knew how to corner jump better, <laughs> then this level would be sorry. You've got to be kidding me. What? What was that? What a good trick. I don't even I don't even know what to make of that, but that was awesome. And the thing about this too is that there's such, such a good tell here. There's two tracks. I should have noticed that. And of course I didn't. Oh. <laughs> That's so good. I hope this level has some more tricks up their sleeve like that. That's really fun. Then again, I don't know if the level needs them. <laughs> I'm falling into plenty of traps all by myself. Oh, okay, I see, I see. Oh no! <laughs> I saw a little too late. I don't even know how I managed that one. <laughs> just right over it. I just bolted it. Shoot. I know at least one commenter said that this is like their favorite level, and I kind of get it. This is really fun. There it is. Oh, I just have to be patient. Just a little more patience. Oh, it's been a bit since it's been frosty. <laughs> Can I just like wave dash my way through this? Clearly I can't be trusted with wave dashing. <laughs> no. So can I just like <laughs> just, just like slowly walk this? Yeah. It did not look as fancy, but <laughs> it got the job done. Maybe one day I'll be better at this game and be able to show off great feats of movement. Until then, <laughs> this is what you get. Hey skeleton. Rude. Rude. Half chilled, cold hearted, half burned, scorched earth. Keep one's polarity to achieve true harmony. Well, I don't know what that's in reference to. Kind of reminds me of like the chapter two poem from the vanilla game. Um, maybe it's to help me get a strawberry. Maybe it's just a poem. <laughs> Who knows? Oh wow. <laughs> I thought I was being pretty good about it, but it got me. Oh. Oh. Okay, so there's totally more. There's totally more of a secret somewhere. First, let's just get over there and then we'll try and figure it out. I might have to play through the level again. Something about balancing out the, like, the hot furnaces and the cold furnaces, maybe? Don't you dare. You <laughs> jerk. I should have realized that touching that was going to give me my bounce back. <laughs> oh, it got me! It got me again! Well, thank you, Level. You did have one more trick up your sleeve. Okay, there we go. So... What do I do here? Do I do something like this and then hold that way? There we go. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> that was very fun. But I'm t I know I'm not done with the core. I mean, there was an obvious, there was an obvious way to go actually several times throughout the level. And yeah, look at that. Zero strawberries. I didn't find a single one this time. Oh, it's been a long time since the level's done that to me. All right, back in I go. And as for you, your time will come. <laughs> Your time will come. So I wonder if my first mistake in the level was actually getting that furnace right there. I might want to just not do that ever. <laughs> okay, so skip this one? Maybe skip this one. I don't know how this would lead to three strawberries, but we'll start here. Okay, that'll work. Just do the room again. Not having the spring here makes this a little more complicated, but... 
I think it's still the same solution, technically. And I can still get a double dash. that way. Take me to my first strawberry, please. <laughs> Wait, did I go this way the last time? Oh man, <laughs> did I just confuse myself? I think I just confused myself and now I've gone the way I'm supposed to go, but I should have gone up first. Hmm. Hmm. All right. <laughs> If I go this way, what actually happens? <laughs> I'm in a brand new area! <laughs> wow, I got turned around. Okay, well, you know what? <laughs> this is the challenge. I can do this. I'm good at these. I'll take that. I got curious how you're actually supposed to do it, so now I'm just messing around. This is far more chaotic. <laughs> ah, and then there's here's another section that I haven't been to. I should not have done this. This was a terrible plan. I'm committed, I think. <laughs> okay, good. It's it's forgiving. Oh, well. Also, I can just neutral jump again if I really wanted to. Neutral jumping here is very powerful. Mine. <laughs> I have to say, I'm really impressed by this level because every single room is basically two challenges in one. It's just so clever. Not to mention a lot of fun trying to figure it out again. There it is. It does make me wonder though, <laughs> which is going to be the better route to try to do the Deathless on? Like is this room as a fire room <laughs> easier <laughs> than it is as an ice room? And I have to think about that for pretty much every challenge. I don't think this one is easier. <laughs> Don't be selfish, give me the jump. That just worked out. <laughs> that just worked out. Um, and so we know where the last strawberry is going to be. It's going to be at the very end of this screen. This is not what I want. <laughs> this is not it. This is not it. <laughs> That was it. <laughs> that was what I wanted. Like that? Yes! <laughs> Great! <laughs> There's all three strawberries of Corsican City. Oh, what a fun level! Uh, I still don't know how to heart ultra. I haven't worked on this yet. <laughs> give me time, give me time, I will. I, I forgot that that's what this level does again! But, but, that is all three strawberries of Corsican City. Alright, I have two things to show you now. The first is something that Bugflower pointed out to me in the last episode and I thought it was too fun not to share. Look at this. How neat is that? And it drops you into Dropples! Dropsles? Dropsles. <laughs> because the two share a level mechanic! How cute is that? That's such a fun touch! I love that. 
And also it puts me here perfectly for this. The log book. Uh, which is the core sticker. There it is. I like the ruby sapphire of it all. Alright. Look at this. <laughs> Just look at this. See something different from the last episode? That's right. <laughs> I've done all of the deathless strawberries for all the levels. And I will be showing those off next time. All that's left is Corsican City and... Ah, there it is. The mysterious Blueberry Bay. <laughs> that was the level that I saw in the soundtrack and got confused by. I was like, wait a minute, I haven't, that, that's not here. But thinking about it a little bit further, it became obvious. It's behind the heart barrier. Let's fill them all in. <laughs> That's so exciting. We did it. We are totally finishing the beginner lobby today. When it comes to the Deathless runs, that's going to be next episode. I've got something fun planned for it, so you're going to have to wait till then. And I promise it's going to be at least a little special. And I hope you'll join me for that. Although I am left to wonder, does Blueberry Bay also have a Deathless Strawberry? I'm not really sure what this level is going to entail. We're going to check it out. But first I'm checking this out. What's over here? <laughs> Look at this little area! Oh, it's so cute! There's a cat up there, I see you. Hello, cat. I've come to either pet you or talk to you. Pet you. <laughs> One of these days there's probably going to be a cat to talk to. Oh, what a cute little house. A little artwork back there. A nice view. Well, this is well worth it already. I do love cozy spots and games for sure. But it's time to step out of that coziness. Let's tackle the last challenge of the beginner lobby. So what is Blueberry Bay? Is it like a summit of the beginner lobby? <laughs> Tides rising, March. Don't miss the sunset. Is it a race? <laughs> I don't want to race. I want to take my nice time. I want to enjoy the ride. Also, we started at the bottom. Oh, we started at the bottom of the ocean. Is that a reference to the vanilla game? How, like, Madeline feels about depression. Well, let's work our way out of that. I like the little bee that's going. Ooh, it just picked up. Oh, there it is. And yes, it does seem like it's a little bit like the summit. We just hit checkpoint 21. All right, let's see how long it takes to get through this. <gasps> is it going to reference each level? Here's my, here's, if my driveway almost did you in. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Oh, this is going to be so fun. I don't remember if you remember, but I remember that I was bad at this. <laughs> what's up here? No, what's up there? All right, with that said, which level am I afraid to replay again? <laughs> Strawberry Orchard, maybe? I love it, but I'm bad. <laughs> oh, I didn't touch the barrier. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It's all sinking in, <laughs> in the, like, the best way. Oh, rats. <laughs> They're so kind to me. I'm still coughing a little bit. Woo! Collapsing skyline. <laughs> That's our next checkpoint. Look at that little gap down there. It's, it's, it even still has those little areas I'm suspicious of. Look at that little gap down there. Let me in. Let me in. I want to go in. All right, and all in one motion then? It's actually more forgiving than that. There's some more paint over there in the glyphs. Uh, <laughs> can I get some more lore here too? Take me to the lore. Oh my gosh, there was lore! There was a place to go! No, 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 no. Wait, it, it, I, I got here! Praise Kingdom, I got here, but like, where? <laughs> where? <laughs> Give me more lore! Alright, alright. No more lore. I got it, I got it. Praise Kingdom. Alright, we'll move on, we'll move on. 
<laughs> I do appreciate that though. Azure Caverns! Am I going to delightedly exclaim each and every level as I approach them? Yeah, probably. <laughs> become quite the little puzzle. No. Should have saved my dash there, but it is good. It's all good. <laughs> troposphere. Please tell me there's a flag somewhere here. Please, please. <laughs> Ooh, Troposphere is not kidding around. Oh my goodness! A feather too! <laughs> Alright, let's just see if I can put this together. Oh, okay, it's gonna have some of those too. Oh, it's got wind as well. <laughs> no, not wind! I made the wrong decision! Oh, and it gave me a checkpoint! <laughs> Just like in the original level. Well, I can't wait for the inevitable deathless, where I have to do all of this perfect anyway. Huh. Which way am I going? Up? doing there but great wait this is this is just the lobby right <laughs> i'm not a, i'm at a checkpoint but i'm not at a i'm not at another map seeing is believing uh oh <laughs> i don't get to pull up my sister for this one make a right jump onto a swap block then keep tapping right okay so this is what this looks like huh Dash upright and hold grab. Then climb up. Wait, I didn't I didn't repeat? Repeat please. Ow. I messed up. It's okay. I got there. <laughs> Wow, it's so bright and cheerful here! It's seeing as believing meets a beautiful harbor. I like it. Well, it's fun. I'm glad I got to experience what it was like, what the level would be like for most people who don't pull in their sister in order to help them out with it. Oop, the squeeze. <laughs> I know you. Um... I live on the spikes now. I have finally learned how to live with the spikes. Oh wait, no, I didn't. I'm just surrounded by spikes. I'm not on the spikes. All right, one day. <laughs> one day I'll learn to live with the spikes. Here. Wait for a second. Drop down. Drop and do this. And yes, great. And wow, we're going right into potential for anything by the looks of it. Uh huh. Uh huh. V. Oh, there we go. I actually really like this like harbor background element, and I think it looks really good with all the levels. I should have expected this. <laughs> it's potential for anything. Everything was on the table with potential for anything. This is one of my favorite parts about potential for anything. Just like the fun screen wraps. 
<laughs> I think this is just so charming. Yeah, I don't know what I was gonna do there. I don't know what my thought process was. Wait, there's a computer there. Area scan complete. Inadequate levels of comfort. No, <laughs> we're just portrait! I'm covering it though! I agree. How do I get out though? Oh, I'm trapped here. <laughs> mean. Wait a minute. Do I even have to do any of this? <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> you got me. You got me. 23, 25. Nope, that's that's some dyslexia for you. 52, 35, 23. Uh, I took a secret break. I went to go eat some food, and now I'm back. I made myself tempura last night, which it was okay. I don't know what I did exactly, but it wasn't quite right. It wasn't as evenly cooked as I wanted it to be. Still though, it tastes pretty good. Oh, we're on the beach now. Oh, yes. I love this place. It's so calming. a large reason why I love just like calming scenery and pretty places in games I think actually has a lot to do with my new outfit <laughs> believe it or not um I based this design off of uh Yokohama Kaidashi Kiko which is just probably my favorite manga of all time it's very slice of life it's very calm it's very peaceful oh, I love it so much and now we're in the forest path I am excited about that. I love these Dream Dash blocks. Anyway, if you haven't read that manga and you like Slice of Life, I would highly recommend it. It's very lovely. It's very cozy. Alright, Tree Hive. The bouncing is about to get wild. Uh huh. I thought there would be one more bounce going that way! Alright, pull it together. Pull it together, March. You're almost done. There's not much left. Okay, hold on. <laughs> yeah, just, just take a moment for yourself. Just take a breather. Into Loopy Lagoon. No, we don't need periscopes here. <laughs> Loopy Lagoon would never do anything bad to us. Right? <laughs> right, Loopy Lagoon? You're my friend! A friend that gives me tough love, clearly. Oh, shoot. I just was low enough to touch the milk! It's alright though. I'm really enjoying the movement here. Definitely a lot of fun. Part of me is like, man, I hope they make me don't they don't make me do this deathless. And the other part of me is like, I hope they make me do this deathless. I don't know which it is. I do know that this is Midnight Spire. Can I go up here? That's the important question with Midnight Spire. Can I go up here? Yes? Um... <laughs> oh, I just had to jump on the cloud! I didn't even see it! Tell you what though, we're not gonna do that. We, we've proved that it's possible, but now we're gonna treat the level, like, properly. I can't cheese someone's level, not when we're celebrating it. I thought about getting up there again. <laughs> There we go. I just want to, though. It's the mystery. It's the exploration again. Uh-oh. Uh-huh. 
I don't, uh, I don't like where this is going. There we go. Um, unsurprisingly, <laughs> since I am technically the March that has already played through all of the, the Deathless stuff, Midnight Spire, uh, it, you know, it was one of those levels where I think it took me two hours. It's up here. Is this where I'm going? It looks like it could go up here. Can I also go this way? No. All right, so I do have to go up there. But over here, though, I just gotta know. Checkpoint number 10 and a gift from the stars. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little weird being in this environment with this like upbeat jazzy music, <laughs> but like this is where we are. I got a Koopo seed. Ah, we do have a puzzle here. I actually think maybe I want... Oh, I don't know. There's our time stop orb. Okay, I need to scout. I need to do some scouting. I've lost all my dashes. And I am going to want this time stop orb. I'm also going to want another dash to get up there. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. I'm more confused than I thought. <laughs> and I'm already a pretty confused kind of girl. This isn't right either, because I still need to dash to get up to the, the orb. Now I've done this. But that doesn't help me, because now I can get up here, but I can't touch this. Are you going to make me draw a diagram again? <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> Don't think I won't. I'll totally draw a diagram. I'm getting my pen. <laughs> Hold on, I just have to get off the page. That's my ribbon note. I've been playing through that game. All right, here's what I've got worked out so far. You need one dash to get back from here. That, that, that makes sense, right? But you need a dash to get here and a dash to get this orb. You also need a dash to get up here. We grab this one first, come up here, and grab this. We wait for a sec, because what this allows us to do is grab this seed and this seed. And now I think I can leave this seed alone so that I can do this and still get back up. As long as I don't mess that up. Yep, so now I can grab this and I am one token up but have both my dashes. We grab this. Now this gives us plus two dashes. We couldn't use this before because we needed to get up over there. Grab all of this. And you know what? We don't even really need that Koopo seed down there. We could actually just grab this orb again, I think, but this seems to be the safe way to do it. And work through. Yay, puzzles. Where are we heading next? Ah, it's Strawberry Orchard! Alright, I took a look in the periscope. I did not see any hidden paths, which is a shame. And also, this is going to be a long one. Oh, I've already messed up. Oops. Good. Saved. All of the deathless stuff I did here is definitely going to pay off. I almost messed that up. But th that's a secret, right? Yes! <laughs> Is this Tilletman? <laughs> this might be Tilletman. Was that the beaver? <laughs> Either way, <laughs> secret achieved! Oh, what was that? Aw, oh, thanks for the checkpoint though. Much appreciated. And then one more. There was a lot of stuff we just passed by, but I don't think any of it was a secret. Maybe it was, maybe it's not. I don't know. No stealing here. Oh, yes, the rose garden. We only have eight more to go as well. We're making some swift progress through these little levels. Okay, great. Where am I going? What am I doing? <laughs> and I think it's just an ascent here. Yes. 
Ah, oh, wonderful. All right, there weren't any secrets in the actual rose garden, but you can't blame me for checking. All right, let's head down. Where we get to see more of our statue friends. Hello. Ah, <laughs> Corsican City. We were just here. So I should be all like warmed up for this one. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh, just like in the actual Corsican City, the movements here are really fun. Oh, no, no, no! <laughs> All right, good. Uh-oh. What are you doing? Oh, darn. I missed my ride. No, okay. I just managed to grab it. Oh, good. We're safe. Oh, <laughs> it's this one. It's over the city. I don't know if I'm ready for you over the city, but I'm going to try. Can I, <laughs> can I neutral jump? Oh, that's because I needed the wall jump. That makes sense. Whatever we do, though, let's try not to get turned around here again. I don't need more humiliation. Maybe three. That'll work! Oh, things got a little bit more uh, technical here. Stuff is happening. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I needed the dash still. Come on, get it. <laughs> Come on! There it is. There. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Look at the heart. All right, over the city. You're not so bad. Oh, I should have done this. <laughs> oh, there it is, though. And then I have absolutely zero fatigue. This can't be right. Good. Now I have fatigue here, which I didn't have before. <laughs> and that gets me through. I don't know how you're supposed to do that without neutral jumping, but I know how to neutral jump. And it looks like we're heading into Switch 2 Vista. Five more to go. Speaking as March from the future, this is also a level that gave me a fair amount of trouble <laughs> to do Deathless. But with all of that practice and with all of that work that it did to do, like that it did take me to do Deathless, um, theoretically. <laughs> theoretically, I'm very equipped to handle this level now. Why? <laughs> Why does this work? <sighs> I'm having such trouble with this now. Whatever I'm doing wrong, stop it. Can I just do this? Yes. And we're free! Alright, bye Switch to Vista. And hello little duck. It looks like we're heading into soap. I put a lot of trust into this level to make sure that like, or to like, that all the elements line up and stuff I guess. Yeah, a lot of trust has to go into this. Oh, jump! Wall jump! <laughs> but once you figure out exactly what the level wants of you, it's actually not that bad. 
and is probably why, again, speaking as the girl who managed to, uh, I got distracted. I didn't know which way I was going. Yeah, speaking as the girl who managed to uh, do this Deathless already, <laughs> um, Soap was one of those levels that took absolutely no time at all once I really got going. I probably practiced for a bit, and then it took me less than, I don't know, 25 minutes to actually do the attempts. I was pretty proud of that. Although, <laughs> I actually technically did it Deathless twice because I completely neglected to practice the very, very last screen of soap with the heart crystal. I forgot that that was even a thing. So I only was practicing up until like the big bubble pool. <laughs> so the first time through, I got through soap. Yeah, I did not win that attempt. Also, uh, that my hair is still short, but it went back to red. <laughs> it's kind of cute and with the bunny ears. Oh my goodness, this is like, oh my goodness. This is the room that's next to the portal into this place. So we're decorating it with all of the pictures of the levels. Oh, that's such a great touch. It's so good. What a fantastic tribute to the lobby. Oh, and these are the three that I haven't done yet, right? What an awesome level. Oh, I have nine dashes here. Oh, we're in for another big puzzle. Oh, we've got to put a lot of blocks away. All right, leave you alone, I think. This is still very dangerous. <laughs> but you can get out of it. And then you... Which direction? I want to be over here? Like this. That should do it. Now I put you away. And drop. I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good. As long as I can get out. Hmm. Well, that's an interesting part of the puzzle I wasn't really thinking about. Wow. Wow, this is mean. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Help me out here. What a fascinating problem. Okay, so we have to have a staircase ready to go too. The case, I'm just going to play around for a little bit. Clearly, I don't have the exact answer yet, so... Okay, I accidentally just stumbled my way into the solution. So that's great. <laughs> I wish I could repeat what I just did. But this is the work. This will work. Sometimes it's just a matter of trial and error and not because you have a stroke of, of brilliance. <laughs> that's the way it goes sometimes. Oh, cassette clips. They had to change the music a little for this one. I actually really like it though, only because like, it's gonna make the timing of this a lot simpler. Yeah, into the water. And right into the, the mound of spikes. Ooh, just made it. Short and sweet. I love it. Short and sweet. <laughs> and we're into paints! Which also just has a very different feel with this music. As ever, I'll be on the lookout for secrets. Maybe some more cats. Some cat statues with poems. Alright, down here for this light bulb. Nope. No, I don't think so. Don't hit me. Don't hit me! <laughs> Stop it! I feel very trapped. Okay, got out. That's a good start. Okay, I would like to not be crushed. No, wait, was there stuff over there? I have to know. 
<laughs> there could have been. Heat is absolutely full of secrets, so there has to be something, right? <laughs> or am I just in denial? No, look at that. I can go up here. Yeah, I thought so. <gasps> Whoa, there's a giant kite fish here. Uh, yeah, yeah, there was no way I wanted to miss this. This is great. We can take a nice little relaxing bath, I guess, down here with our friend the kite fish. Big kite fish. Such a big kite fish. <laughs> I love you. Well, <laughs> we're very close to the end. All we have to do is really get through this last one, I think. So, as much as I love our giant kite fish friends, let's put an end to this. Looks like we're not quite done with the climb yet. I really keep thinking that these are going to fling me further than they do. No, wait, I'm not ready. <laughs> Especially not with the paintbrushes. All right. Do your worst. <laughs> no, we're not doing this again. Yeah, just like that. That's how you actually get around that obstacle. Got it. Blah, blah. sure I really, really get that jump, right? <laughs> oh, we made it. We're up the top. Oh, our cat friends are here. They're having a strawberry picnic. Oh, and we get a nice view. <laughs> oh, I'm growing addicted to these nice views. I really like them. We're just about done with this level. I think we made it. Oh, there's an entire little village here. So amazing. Okay. Ooh, it's like the prologue cave, except all bamboo and really pretty. And there's the cat up there. Hello, we'll pet you. There we go. <gasps> Kiki reference. Oh my gosh, it's a Kiki celebrity reference. It has to be. Red bow, broomstick. <laughs> I am feeling particularly catered to <laughs> this level. I'll sit here for a moment. I'll enjoy myself. I'm a little too close to the fire, though. <laughs> Should probably sit on the log. What a beautiful bisexual sunset. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I enjoyed myself. <gasps> Yay, draft bug! <laughs> Yay! I'm always so giddy whenever I get to see one of you. <laughs> I love you. Oh, and here we are. <laughs> the ends. The very ends of the level. What an incredible climb this was. What a wonderful way to go through every single episode. What a fantastic capstone <laughs> to the beginner lobby. I had so much fun playing it. And as it looks like this is the very last heart we're collecting here, <laughs> I just wanna I just wanna take a moment to reflect on that and to say how much I enjoyed the whole experience. I got so much better playing Celeste over the course of these videos. I really feel like it. It doesn't always look like it, but I feel like it. I'm definitely excited. I'm definitely, definitely excited to check out the intermediate lobby and to continue growing, to continue getting better. But that's going to have to wait for later. Right now, we're going to grab this heart. There's nothing over there and March swam off into the distance, never to return. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sorry, that's a terrible fan fiction. Um, and then she came back because she missed you all. Evan Flo. Oh, that makes sense. I feel like I've seen that somewhere, maybe on the soundtrack. I think one of the songs might've been called that. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, so cute! Hold on, can I please let me grab a picture of this? Give me a moment. It's so cute, I have to have a screenshot of this. It's so good! Lobby complete!
Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, it's so cute. New desktop background for me? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe a new desktop background for me. I love it so much. And we get the actual credits. Well, I probably am not going to make you guys watch all of this, but I'm certainly going to sit here and watch all this. I have a couple last closing thoughts before I probably end today's episode. I think we definitely have enough as far as recording goes. And uh, I want to talk about the golden straw or the, the rainbow strawberry in a moment. Uh, but like I said, I'm going to watch this first. So I'll see you in a minute. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Wait, does it? You can pick those up? You can pick them up? Is that what I'm missing? <laughs> I guess I'm gonna go pick up a crab. Okay. <laughs> is, is that what I'm doing? Oh, it is. All right, little guy, you're coming with me. <laughs> We're going on an adventure together. So what was the point of all this? What do you do, crab? Uh, once I get you up there, what do you do? I have brought you crab. I have tossed the crab. Okay, that's a... Uh, we're just sling it. <laughs> crab? Get buddy! Oh, and there's a cat here. Ah, uh, hidden cats. <laughs> crab leads to cats, of course. Also, I think our, wait, our crab exploded into confetti? Well, now I just feel like a monster. Poor crab. Well, there is a cat to pet. Make me feel better. Our lobby is complete. All of our levels are complete. And we solved the mystery of the crab. I just have two things. Two things, okay? Just two more things. And they're quick. The first is, is there a deathless strawberry in this level? I need to know that before ending for today. Just because, like, if so, I need to mentally prepare myself for that. Oh, dear. Hey. That's not for today. <laughs> that is not for today. And the very last thing I wanted to do today was take a look at this, this, this strawberry. The rainbow strawberry is filling in and I haven't looked at it since I had 13 out of 20. This is what it looks like. 20 out of 21. But is that even true? <laughs> Shouldn't it be 22 out of 21? Is that like... <laughs> Listen, can we call this lobby complete? Is it truly complete? <laughs> And until I get all of the deathless strawberries and the very final golden deathless strawberry. Then I think we can call the beginner lobby complete. And that, that is my plan for next time. Yes, I, I have quite the ambitions for the next episode of Strawberry Jam. And we'll just have to see if I'm able to accomplish them. But at the very least, I think we can truly, truly 100% the beginner lobby. Like I hinted at earlier, <laughs> I have some special plans for the next episode. It's not just going to be a show of my deathless attempts. No, 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 no. <laughs> I have something a little special plans. And I hope you'll enjoy it if you choose to join me for that. <laughs> but as ever, if you made it this far into the video, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you for letting me practice my craft and, uh, well, <laughs> for keeping me company during what was <laughs> honestly a really fun final climb. I'm definitely making that lobby complete photo my, my background. <laughs> 100%. Anyway, until I see you all next time, I hope you stay well. And until then, goodbye and thank you so much. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I almost completely forgot about the logbook. I never showed this off after finishing Blueberry Bay. <gasps> that would have been a blunder. There you go. There are my stats for this one. I wonder how much trying to do this deathless is going to add to that. That'll be fun.